Welcome back everyone to a new video. Today guys, I'm unboxing my brand new GPU. I've decided to go with the ASUS AMD Radeon 7900 XTX. Originally, I wanted to go for an RTX 5070 Ti, but the prices are absolutely insane as you can see. Nvidia is just impossible to get now. So I've decided to go for Team Red for once. This is my first ever AMD GPU. Um, I've always had an NVIDIA. My first ever NVIDIA card was a 1060, uh, 6 gig, then I went to a 1070 Ti, and now I'm on a 3070, which is still an incredible card. Um, but this card hopefully will be able to give me that performance that I really want. I did get this for a good price. I got it for around like 850 euros, um, which is not bad whatsoever. Um, it's an absolute top of the line card. I'm pretty sure this is basically... AMD's like either its best card or maybe second best card because there is new ones out but this one has more VRAM and uh, the price that I got for it was too good so I had to go for it. I did get it on eBay but the guy that sold it to me literally um, bought it and then he was able to get him some 5090 so I think I've done well. Hopefully I haven't been scammed. I am quite worried that maybe I got scammed but I'm going to open it up for you guys and yeah I'm going to show you the box first. Um, so this is the side, 24 gig, um, dual, as you can see, like, he's either put it back on or he didn't use it. So as you can see, the stickers are still here, so I don't know, did he just, like, put them back on and, like, he did a quite a good job of making this look brand new, so I'm pretty happy anyways. But I think this card is going to be brilliant, because now I can actually record and stream in 4K, which would be nice with the extra bit of VRAM and power in it. So I am very, very excited. All right, guys, I got it out of its box. I'm very nervous because I genuinely thought I got scammed for a while because I'm pretty sure like Linus Tech Tips, big YouTuber, um, made a video literally like a day after I bought this on eBay, basically he's talking about how like a lot of like GPU eBay scams are going around. I was like, oh my God, no, please don't do that to me. Because it was, I got it for a really good price. Like these normally go for around 1,000, 100 or 1,200. And I got it for like 850. So when I thought about it afterwards, I was like, oh my God, is this too good to be true? But um, here we go anyways. All the original packaging, I'm very excited. Man, I swear to God, if there's a brick inside of this, I'm actually gonna cry. If there's a genuine brick. All right, here we go. Oh my God. Okay, well, there is a GPU in here. That's good. There is a GPU. <laughs> and it does seem to be great quality. Like it looks like everything's here. I am trembling because I'm terrified that I'm going to put this in my computer and it's just going to blow up. Um, but it seems like everything else, like he literally kept it pretty good condition. So, but yeah, I'm very pleased. I don't know what's going to be in here. Give me one second, guys. I'm going to unbox this and also this. I think you're, you can like build a little something here. It's like a little buildable thing. And then you also get a quick start and some sort of crap. But um, I do find it quite funny that I went for Asus. Like, if you know my channel long enough, you know um, I have an Asus laptop. So when I got this, I was quite, I was kind of found a bit funny now that I can still put Asus in the titles of videos and stuff. I just, I found that quite funny. But um, time to have a look at the GPU. Okay, guys. So this is the RX 7900 XTX. Now, apparently this card is more powerful than a 5070 Ti. Um, on par or even more powerful than a 4080 or yeah i think it's on par to 4080 a little bit less than a 4090 above 50 so yeah this is the card Um, it's quite beefy i'm very excited so here's all the ports Um, i'm very excited like it looks like he kept it in great condition he said it was barely used so I am going to be doing a few test videos. I'm thinking of testing probably Stalker 2, maybe India Jones. Um, but from what I was saying a second ago, my camera cut out. Basically, this card, uh, performance-wise native, is more powerful than the cards I've just previously talked about. But without the whole ray tracing thing, that's where AMD kind of falls down a bit. But honestly, I rather care more about frames per second, resolution and graphics over like um fake frames from like dlss4 or ray tracing and um, just i don't really use ray tracing and i never really thought it was worth it for the performance you lose and i don't really care about fake frames i'd rather get native frames 
with good resolution and great graphics. Um, so I think this was the perfect card to get. Anyways, guys, if you're excited to see the games being tested on this, I will have probably Stalker 2 tested on this in about two days after this comes out. So if you're excited for that, please hit the like button, subscribe. We are now on 1,000 subscribers, so I just want to say a humongous thank you to everyone. It's absolutely insane. And yeah, if you guys want me to test any game, I'm probably going to just test these. When I do test games on this GPU, it's probably just going to be 1440p and 4K. And just because like, I think it's obvious this card's going to run games in 1080p, no problem. But maybe I'll do 1080p if you guys really, really want it. But uh, tell me down in the comments below, guys, what games would you like me to test out? And I'll make sure I do so for you guys. But uh, yeah, I am very, very excited. It literally still has the plastic on this. That is absolutely insane. But uh, yeah, I'm very, very excited. Thanks, guys, for watching. Bye-bye.